Hi everybody, Breaking Eves here. Welcome to today's video. So today's video is my experience in 2024 using Ubuntu 24.04 with the Wayland display driver and snap apps on an entry level, very budget PC. So this is my installed and set up um, Ubuntu, she's absolutely gorgeous, everything is fully functional. Uh, uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and add some apps. We are using the Wayland display driver. Um, and I wanted to see what um, the latest stable. I wanted to see what the Wayland slash uh, Snaps experience is like in 2024. As Ubuntu 24.04 is designed and shipped with both Wayland and Snaps. Initial feelings are that um, it's absolutely fine. Everything is very stable and very quick. However, I have noticed the snaps initially take quite a while to load. I have installed both OBS and Steam as a snap rather than the regular um, software versions. So um, I'm going to try and make uh, every scrap of content that I do on this machine uh, Wayland plus snaps. You'll also notice that I've upped the resolution to 1080p from the old 720p even though the hardware in the machine hasn't changed um, and it seems initially to be handling it just fine. Um, I will do, uh, I've limited I've only put a 250 gigabyte SSD in there deliberately to limit me to the kinds of software that I can install. Um, I've installed basically five games. So I've got American Truck Simulator, Domination, Farming Simulator, Guild Wars 2 and Star Trek Timelines. Um, because it's kind of a nice mixture of simulator slash strategy slash MMORPG slash mobile. Um, and as I say, Steam is running purely as a snap. And it does seem fine. But, um, you know, I mean, initial response is quite slow. Um, whether that's because it's caching it, I don't know. But as you can see, once it's loaded and cached, it's absolutely fine it's blistering um if this all continues to run uh and operate as it is then the only response i would have would be wow and <clears throat> i'd love to heartily recommend this and really push it hard to each and every one of you um but especially with Wayland or with Snaps, I'm guessing your mileage is going to vary uh, immensely from amazing to absolutely terrible, um, depending on your hardware compatibility. You know, because everybody's is different, everybody's experience will be um, different. Mm. So, this is uh, regular software plus snaps, whereas Mint is regular software plus flat pack. That's very interesting, isn't it? Uh, I don't know if there's a snap available for Discord. Mm, probably. Um, but I really did fancy going, um, I know Arch users will laugh at this, but going bleeding edge as far as Ubuntu is concerned. This is about as bleeding edge as it gets for Ubuntu. <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, and so far, uh, I've not been. 
disappointed. Um, the setup was slick and professional um, and was so easy even a child could do it. Um, and as I say, so far I've not had a single issue using Snaps and Wayland, but as I say, uh, your mileage may vary. You do have um, Xorg to fall back on should you need it. Um, so that's quite nice. Um, again, I don't know how these are going to fare. But we'll do our best for you. That's not going to take, is it, for some reason? There we go. Uh, no. I actually wanted it that way around. Steam with the game. Um, the apps that I'm that I'm after are uh, fairly regular. There's nothing out of the ordinary. Um, okay, so that's that all done. So that just leaves me one final app to bring down. Actually, I should check, but I'm sure it's not available as a snap. No. Uh, Ultimate Media Downloader. Yeah, no. Okay, so I didn't know if it was available. It's not. So... Um, we're going to have to bring this down the old school way, of course. Well, some would say the, uh, the standard way. Uh, really. Download Chrome 64-bit for Debian and Ubuntu. Let's stick it in Downloads. Now, I do use Google Chrome for my dodgy boxing. Um, and this is the first ever video I've created using Wayland. So I'm really, really excited. And I'm hoping it's, it's going to be everything I want it to be and hope it will be. Let's go to Downloads. Here's the Debian. Uh, let's open uh, could not display Google Chrome stable. Da, 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 there is no app installed for it. Ah, okay, no apps found. Okay, that's interesting. Um, so it doesn't want me to install um, .deb files out the box. Is GDB available in the repos? I wonder. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's bring GDB down. <coughs> now, I don't know if this is um, going to compromise the system because you're not really supposed to install uh, .deb files, are you? Just saying, but... I don't see how a .deb file is any different to a snap package. <laughs> I'm just saying. But then again, I'm just your average, everyday, run-of-the-mill, ho-hum user. What the hell do I know? Open with GDB. There we go. Now we can close that, maximise that. I don't know if it will maximise. Yeah, it will. Okay, so it should be ready, I think, to install. Let's pop our system password in. Our super secret system password. It didn't like maximising, did it? Uh, automatically close when finished. I'm using the dark theme. Not that that's of any consequence. And there we go. Let's wait. And we should have our 
beloved Google Chrome installed. Okay, so let's close that down. Uh, and there is indeed Google Chromey. Firefox is our uh, daily driver. Let's go to settings. And let's go to Ubuntu desktop. Icon size is 48 at the minute. We can make it 40. And that should be just fine. There we go. That's beautiful. So I need to do a couple of bits and pieces on Google Chrome. But let's go ahead and try some of the apps out that we've installed so starting with gimp see so, yeah. how again this is the uh, the first one I do, I do like the notifications just to confirm yeah that's absolutely tickety boo and let's try vlc which we also bought down i'm not going to try discord uh no points uh, and I bought VLC down to um, be able to view the extra media. Um, I'm running an AMD RX 580 graphics card, 8 gigabyte. Um, so um, you see what I mean? It takes forever initially for it to load up. But once it's loaded and it's ran for the first time, then it's just fine. Um, so let's go to YouTube videos. Uh, this is the one I'm currently recording. Let's open that with VLC and see what it does. Well, that looks fantastic and it's using Wayland as well. That's just a test recording that I did using and running all the different games uh, that I've downloaded uh, under Wayland. And it looks stunning in 1080p. Absolutely stunning. Uh, again, because most apps, not all apps, but most apps are snaps, then the initial first run uh, takes a while to load. But once it's first run and loaded, um, it's pretty good to go. Yep. All we need is a few good men. That's fantastic. So that runs beautiful, complete with audio. So I'm a happy boy. So there you go, everybody. Um, Ubuntu 24.04 with Wayland plus Snap packages in 2024 on a very entry-level PC. All I can say is, wow, why are you still using Windows? You'd have to be out of your tiny mind to run Windows when Ubuntu is this good. Thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, thumb the videos up or down. I will see you for another wicked Broken Eves video.